Hey, if you are a star or celebrity, then I know a fan, oh man, she'll jump out of her tree. So look out, here comes Pepper. So look out, here comes Boy Named Kidding Tom. You better run for the hills. She'll try and erase till she gets your autograph. If you refuse, it could be your epitaph. You give her the chills, she's Pepper. Welcome to Indiana War Memorial with your host Pepper Mills and Loud Kitty Turn. <laughs> Glad to hear it because I'm proud to be bringing you a very special document. Thank you, Miss Hedgebug. Thank you. I'll be paying you all off later. Here's the first clip to break the ice. Hey, hi, I'm George Washington, patriot, father of our country, and denture wearer. Boy, was that ever embarrassing. You know, over the years, I've tried all sorts of false teeth. Dentures made from the teeth of hippos, cows, walruses. Hey, I even had a full set made out of wood. Fine, but you dropped a hammer on my head. I'm trying to come up with an idea. Ow, and be careful with those apples. And while President Lincoln had sons named Robert and Edward, President Kennedy had brothers named Robert and Edward. The ice cream truck's here? Here's our 32nd president, Franklin Roosevelt, famous for his fireside chats. Soviet Premier Joseph Stalin, American President Franklin Roosevelt, and British Prime Minister Winston Churchill. Gentlemen, to finish off our meal, we will call this cake peace, because nobody likes war, and violence is a terrible, terrible thing. What are you, some kind of bomb? 828,000 square miles of North America, stretching from the Mississippi River to the Rocky Mountains. Okay, so I wasn't such a Soviet Union, but I made up for it. I was such a nice guy. Oh, not you, dude. I just came up with the name of my band. Nasty Head Wound Rocks! Well, that's all the time we have for today's show. And maybe you could be the...